Okay, hi. I'm Alan. This is Daddy. We like to go. I'm um, goof around and go on adventures together. Today we're at the Art Institute of Chicago. Although it's only the second and largest art museum in the U.S., it's probably the best. It has 5,000 years worth of worth of painting with 260,000 works of art. 260,000 works of art, and we're going to look at each and every one. We are. And it has three million square feet. Three million square feet, and uh, at least uh, six or seven cubist feet. Get it, cubist feet? <laughs> <laughs> it's a joke. Uh, it's an art joke. The place is absolutely huge, and it, and our 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 square feet and our cubist feet are all worn out. It was a very long day, and we tried to see the yep, whole... these feet. We st the little boy feet. We tried to see the whole 5,000 years worth of art all at once, and we did, but we had to move through really quickly. The museum is only half the story at the Art Institute of Chicago. The School of the Art Institute of Chicago, located in the same building, is one of the finest art schools in the world. Artists as diverse as Walt Disney and Georgia O'Keeffe studied there, or in students major, or in all kinds of subjects, including fashion design, art history, art education, filmmaking, historic preservation, arts administration, and on and on and on. The Art Institute of Chicago is in the heart of the city, just east of the loop and west of Lake Michigan. And while the terrific architecture of the building is surrounded by beautiful sculptures and gardens, the hustle and bustle of city life is evident. His job is to make potholes. Another union guy will come by in six months to fill it in. That's the Chicago way. But the museum is a quiet refuge from the city. At least it was until we got there. A guy got mad at Daddy for talking too loud. Well, I have this big paratone voice and I get excited and it, it sort of has the appearance of being obnoxious when it's really just enthusiasm. Okay, I'll be quiet now and we can look at the art. Anyway, you can't really describe the museum without describing all of art history because it's all there. And in some ways, it's not just an art museum but a history museum because all of the artwork reflects the time and economics and culture and politics and technology and so on of the moment in which it was created. Some of the artwork in there is absolutely astounding. In fact, most of it is astounding. And it's everything from sculpture to paintings to Decorative arts, uh, suits of armor. Alan enjoyed the suits of armor. Clank, 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 clank. And uh, so, you know, he said all kinds of art from pastels and oils and watercolors, which still confuses me because what color is water? See what I mean? Watercolor seems like a bit of an oxymoron. The oxymoron and the moron. <laughs> I can't say that. <laughs> we decided to put our own spe special artwork on display at the Art Institute, so I brought along the sidewalk chalk. The artist signing his work. Now that his artwork has been displayed at the Art Institute of Chicago, it could be worth millions, at least until the next rain. How would you describe your artwork? Tell us about it, Master. Well, um, it's, it's in the Allen style from the Allen School of Art. Wow. That's how, that's how I describe it. Fantastic. Yeah. Oh. Some people have to have respect for art. They just, a million dollar painting. They just went to the middle of our artwork. We worked so hard on it on the sidewalk. Oh. 
But it's like it's like a happening. It's like it's meant to be that way. Look at all these people coming to see our lovely artwork. Yes. Yes, it's a it's our first it's our first gallery showing. It is showing the meaninglessness of life. That even as we've created artwork, people just trod all over it. More people walking across our artwork. There's 260,000 and two works of art at the Art Institute now. Because Alan and I just added our own artwork to this fine collection. What do you think of our artwork? Do you like the, our self-portraits? This, our artwork. Those are self-portraits. Do you like them? Yeah, thank you. I appreciate that. Someday these could be worth millions of dollars if the rain doesn't wash it away. Bye.